So health is, is, is holistic. You know, you have emotional health, you have financial health, which is a very touchy subject with, with, with a lot of folks, you know, and um, uh, you have relationship health, you know, so all of these components are very, very important. So um, when it comes to exercise, I think consistency um, is the key. So making exercise a normal way of life. And our kids too, kids today, all they wanna do is sit around and play video games or on their, on their phones. Parents sometimes are very hard on their kids, but we didn't grow up in, in the era they're in. So if we had the same uh, temptations at our disposal, we, we would probably have been guilty as well. We had Atari and what do we have, uh, uh, Nintendo or so, some of those things, you know, video game, arcade games, and I spent all my money on video games, by the way. And I ate candy too back then. I don't eat candy today, but, um, you know, making your kids go outside, you know, getting them to be, you know, and it's tough because people are very worried about you know, they're, you know, we live in a crazy world today, you know, so you've got to constantly uh, monitor your children, what they're doing, but activity level, kids should, should at least four or five times a week, they should have at least 30 minutes of exercise a day. Um, I like grace because kids are outside, they have the recesses, I think that's great at a lot of schools, they don't have those things. Um, so making exercise a normal part of your life, and here's the key parents, it has to start with you. Kids see you, they imitate what you do, and if you're not consistent with it, then kids are not gonna be consistent with it as well. Um, I think emotional wellness is very important, um, and obviously uh, part of that is really what you put in your body. If you're not putting the proper things in there, you're gonna have the emotional outburst. You're gonna have a lot of challenges in terms of your emotional health, and then obviously financial wealth. I, what I tell parents, they say, look, we, 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 we have to, watch every penny that comes into our home. What I tell them is there maybe there's some sacrifices you can make elsewhere, but when it comes to nutrition, that is non-negotiable. In our household, that's non-negotiable in terms of what they eat, their experiences and education, the three E's which I focus on, are non-negotiable in the Funderburg household. I am very frugal, I'm very cheap. I know people say, oh, you played in the NBA, you made all this money. No, no, let me, let me, let me correct something. I am very diligent about uh, being a good uh, steward over our resources and I am a cheapskate. I am. I'm am frugal. I'm a cheapskate and my, my kids tell me that all the time but I will not sacrifice when it comes to their education particularly Christian education is very important their experiences in terms of what we uh, what we uh, um, what we help them to uh, to learn about their experiences in terms of vacations and those things and then also eats the three E's I think are very important and I think parents you have to have non-negotiables, make sacrifices in other areas, but never make sacrifices in terms of what you put in your body, what you put on your body and what you put your body through. Yeah, what you put your body through is really the exercise. So here at Fundamax Fitness, we don't have um, equipment. So what we say is you can't hide behind equipment, you have to do the work. And I think for a lot of people who particularly are not, you know, very, um, I say uh, acclimated to exercise, you know, maybe start walking. When you start walking, pick it, pick it up. Sometimes maybe do some lunges, maybe do some squats, do some push-ups, do some dips. There are a lot of things that you can do. And for some people say, you know, I don't really have the money to, 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 to come and have a private trainer. But there are a lot of things you can do. There are a lot of videos online, exercises. The thing for a lot of people is, is consistency in making time and carving it out because you're gonna pay at the front end and you're gonna pay at the back end, but you're gonna pay one way or the other. And I think it's very important that exercise, what you put your body through is critically important for a lot of people. All, gut, all health is predicated on how healthy your gut is, your metabolism, your immune system, how your cells are responding. All of these things are really in your gut. So it's very, very important that you take care of your gut. Anything I do is I start with the gut. Anytime I work with athletes, kids, I start with their, the abdomen, I start with their, 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 their core. That is a critical component. If you have, if you look at a lot of our athletes, a lot of our great athletes are, are great in sports because they have great core. So your core, your gut, your intestines, all of these things are critically important for not only your health, but also just your overall wellness of your life.